and um, in both places we took every single hotel room that was there, uh, and then some. Mm -hmm. um, in so, downtown Perry too. Yeah, in downtown, and and and, and our production in in Brunswick we had an old school. We had the old middle school as our production office in Perry. We basically all the empty storefronts in the downtown area became our production offices, and. Um, and I've, I've heard this, like I said, it, it, I think Tom would be a better person to, to validate this, but that because of, of this tax program that we have, uh, it's economically feasible for all of Georgia to be considered um, to do that. Whereas prior to that, it, it, you know, you, you were somewhat restricted to where crew was, but it, it actually, it's an, it's an easier thing to it, it sort, of, sort of broadens our scope really statewide now to be able to do that. And, and, we, and we do that. We just go into these communities and we take old storefronts and make them our production offices or take the empty school and make it our production offices and we live in the hotels or apartments or empty houses that are available or rental houses that are available. And, and that's a significant impact to the local community. I've, I've seen, seen it happen in Perry and I've seen it happen in Brunswick and um, just what what it happens to restaurants and, and those things is very significant. Yeah, you know, oftentimes we'll put our um, our main actors if we're shooting in a, in a relatively rural location. We'll look to the community to see if there are houses that they can rent. You know, um, that sort of thing. I've done quite a bit, and, and and the cast tends to prefer that actually. So, you know, we don't all have to stay at the Holiday Inn. Um, it, you know, we do uh, we do quite a bit of that sort of thing. That's another way you all can help us quite a bit, just knowing who is willing to uh, rent a place. You know, a lot of times um, people have houses um, that they live in part time, and knowing those people, and you know, they might have a, a farmhouse out in the country and then a house in town. And knowing who's willing to uh, let us have those kind of places is a good thing. We in Douglas and Coffee County, we had the oldest. World War II flight training base in the United States. But are we better off to, while we're trying to point to that, also show quaint restaurants and old churches and tobacco warehouses and cotton warehouses? And Absolutely. All Those things are hard to find. Package. Yeah. Package. Those things are, the, 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 everything you mentioned, I've, I've had to look for in the past few years. And they're, um, the, you know, the, those, Construction like that is getting very old and very dangerous, and, and people are carrying these things down. So if you have these things, they're they're right, right and and, and we, we should know about them. Pretty well renovated. Oh yeah, we should know about them. That sounds great. I'd love to see. But them. you'd like to see a package of everything we had that could could drop. Well, I, I think it's what Pam and, and Craig were saying is that when you have something unique and interesting, uh, to go on and 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 kind of because our timelines are so compressed, we ju we need it now. I'd love it to be different, but it's never going to be different. And we need it now. And if you know that something's that interesting, um, I would would encourage you to get go on and just be proactive and get photographs of it and get it to the to the database, so that um, that immediate uh, output can happen when that request comes in. It may may not come in for a week. It may not come in for a month or six months. But it, it certainly, if it's unique and interesting, it, it certainly could change things for a producer or a director who's looking for something unique and interesting but hasn't quite figured out what he wants yet. Anybody else have any questions? This is a great time to, to ask. Nothing? Well, then I guess we're going to wrap it up. And thanks for coming. I hope this